The final table is set in the 2011 Aussie Millions $100,000 Challenge. 38 players put up the massive buy-in, but only 8 remain. Here are your finalists. Sam Trickett has pretty much held the chip lead wire to wire, entering the final table with 961000 The Nottingham Great Britain resident has a chance to double his $1.5 million in tournament earnings if he takes down the $1.525 million first place prize. Second in chips is this event's champion from 2009, David Stuckey with 622000 in chips. The Hong Kong resident has lifetime tournament earnings of $1.675 million. Close behind in third position is Eric Seidel with 619000 Seidel has had a lot of success down under, finishing runner-up in this event in 07 and coming runner-up in the main event the following year. But he is surely looking to tack on another million and a half to his already staggering $10.6 million in lifetime earnings. James Opes of Adelaide, Australia is in fourth chip position with 571000 Opes has amassed more than $2.1 million in tournament earnings, with his largest cash being $184,000 for a win in the Spring Championship of Online Poker. Fifth in chips is Jeffrey Lissandro with $454,000. The Salermo, Italy resident has an impressive $4.4 million in lifetime tournament earnings, and is looking to improve on his fourth place finish in this event in 2008. In sixth chip position is David Benjamin of Paris, France, with 363000 Benjamin has lifetime tournament earnings of $4.2 million, with his biggest ever cash coming from a runner-up finish in the 2008 WPT Bellagio Cup. Seventh in chips is 2004 Aussie Millions Main Event Champion and 2009 $100,000 Challenge runner-up Tony Bloom, with 148000 the London native has had his greatest tournament success down under and will be looking to increase his $1.7 million in tournament earnings today. Rounding out the final table is Chris Ferguson with $89,000. Ferguson is the 2000 WSOP main event champion and he has amassed $7.8 million in tournament earnings over his impressive career. These eight players are returning for the final table but only six will make the money and only one will take the $1.525 million first place prize and the title of 2011 Aussie Millions $100,000 Challenge Champion.